Learning English through funny stories. The elephant. Hello. Welcome to Learning English through Funny Stories channel. Today we are going to do English listening and reading practice with a new short story. First, you are going to listen to the story. Then you will hear a lot of easy questions about the story. Try to answer these question out loud. You will improve your listening skill quickly. Now listen to the story, and we will do English speaking practice with the question and answer method. Okay, are you ready? Let's get started. A. Listen to story. Mr. Williams was a gardener and a very good one too. Last year, he came to work for Mrs. Elphinstone, who was old, fat, and rich. She knew nothing about gardens, but thought that she knew a lot and was always interfering. One day, Mr. Williams got angry with Mrs. Elphinstone and called her an elephant. She did not like that at all, so she went to a lawyer. And a few months later, Mr. Williams was in court, accused of calling Mrs. Elphinstone an elephant. The magistrate found Mr. Williams guilty, so Mr. Williams said to him. Does that mean that I am not allowed to call this lady an elephant anymore? That is quite correct, the magistrate answered. And am I allowed to call an elephant a lady? The gardener asked. Yes, certainly, the magistrate answered. Mr. Williams looked at Mrs. Elphinstone and said, "Goodbye, lady." Damn! B. True or false? Which of these sentences are true and which are false? One, Mrs. Elphinstone was better at gardening than Mr. Williams. Two, Mrs. Elphinstone interfered in gardening affairs because she knew nothing about gardening and wanted to learn. Three, Mr. Williams called her an elephant because she was old and rich. Four. Mr. Williams called her an elephant because she was fat and because her name was Elphinstone. Five. Mr. Elphinstone sent Mr. Williams to a lawyer. Six. Mrs. Elphinstone won the court case. C. Answer the questions. One. What Mr. Williams do when he got angry with Mrs. Elphinstone? Two. And what did Mrs. Elphinstone do about this? Three. What did the magistrate decide? Four. What did Mr. Williams ask him then? Five. What did the magistrate answer? Six. What did Mr. Williams ask then? Seven. And what was the magistrate's answer this time? Eight. So what did Mr. Williams do then? D. Listen again. Mr. Williams was a gardener 
and a very good one too. Last year, he came to work for Mrs. Elphinstone, who was old, fat, and rich. She knew nothing about gardens, but thought that she knew a lot, and was always interfering. One day, Mr. Williams got angry with Mrs. Elphinstone, and called her an elephant. She did not like that at all, so she went to a lawyer, and a few months later Mr. Williams was in court, accused of calling Mrs. Elphinstone an elephant. The magistrate found Mr. Williams guilty, so Mr. Williams said to him, does that mean that I am not allowed to call this lady an elephant anymore? That is quite correct, the magistrate answered, and am I allowed to call an elephant a lady? The gardener asked. Yes, certainly, the magistrate answered. Mr. Williams looked at Mrs. Elphinstone and said, goodbye, lady. Okay, that is the end of our video. Please watch the video many times until you answer the questions quickly and confidently.